Hey, we're trying something a little bit different for this food truck Friday. So many great places to eat here in the borderland, but what about ramen? You see me here with some chopsticks here. Tim is here with us today. Tim, thank you for coming on the show with us. Tim, I got to ask you straight up first. This guy brought the biggest bowl of ramen. Hold on, it's this way. Okay. Biggest bowl of ramen ever. Before we get to this, you guys are doing some phenomenal work in the community, Tim. I want you to speak about that, how you're helping out local El Paso businesses that want to get into the food truck business. We try to build them a quality food truck for a lot less money than a lot of other food truck builders are making them for with all commercial equipment and everything they need to do business anywhere in the state of Texas or any other surrounding state around us. Because we are a low income city, so a quality product for a lower price just makes sense. It does. I remember you were telling me one as soon as you came in, the normal prices of a food truck, I believe you were saying it was around 75000 or something. You said you helped this uh, wife and husband combo and sold it for around twenty-five to thirty. How beneficial is that just somebody wanting to get into the food truck business? It's very beneficial. It gives them more money of their savings for their overhead to get started to get going, advertising products more safety stuff for their trucks now that we have COVID going on. It just makes it a lot easier because now they don't have to worry about having those huge bank loans to stay in business. Okay, well you're helping out the El Paso businesses and you're also helping out my taste buds. Tell me what do I have in front of me right now? You have our smoked tomahawk ramen bowl. Oh my goodness. It you is a two and a half pound tomahawk ribeye that is smoked to a perfect medium rare <laughs> and then reverse seared upon serving. All right, let me go ahead and try this bad boy out. How's it supposed to taste? That tastes like a beautiful smoked steak right there. Sorry about that production. This <laughs> is delicious, right? I don't know if you guys could see this at home. See, it doesn't require like that much This is like the Flintstone joints up here. Like <laughs> and since the, since the bone is smoked, it's perfect if you have a dog. I taste the smokeness of I was just about to ask you about that. So when you come, is this the actual size that you get? That is the same. Everything that we brought today is the same exact thing you get served. This is delicious. Tell everybody where you're located at and where your business hours are. We're located on Zaragoza at 1651 North Zaragoza. We're open Tuesday through Saturday from 12 till 8 p.m. on the weekdays and then on Friday and Saturday till 9 p.m. Oh my goodness. Well, this is delicious. I'm going to have to go back by there and try out. That's the vegan option that you're seeing on the screen right there. And my mom's a vegetarian, so she's definitely going to want to try that out. Thank you guys for coming on the show, and I definitely appreciate it. And I'll be out there this weekend. Try some ramen, Borderland. Pretty we'll good stuff. We'll be glad to have you. Thank you. Susie? Uh, yeah.